if you think you're as good as an NHL pro, then why not test your skills in the Pro-Am challenges? I've seen some surprise upsets from community members here in the world of Chell, and those have always been entertaining matchups. Carlin here and just a tip for all you club owners out there a good goal song is just as important as a good goal make sure your club has the right jam to celebrate those pucks hitting the back of the net and get your squad fired up Look you on, I couldn't wait I should've known you couldn't hold your own 
Beautiful night for hockey. Let's get set to drop the puck. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Let's go. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. Oh, I've been waiting for this all day, and we are now officially underway. And that doesn't exactly go take to take. Moves it ahead from off the wall. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. And they fail to go take to take. And now he moves it to Datsu. Puck picked up by Fowler. Tries to get it over to Fisher. Strong defensive effort. Steps inside the line. There's the whistle as the play was offside. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. We've still got zeros on the board. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Flies it on over to Pooh. Oh, and he just gets a piece of it. Great extension on the play. Turn that one aside. Right spot makes the double save. Positioning does it all. Take it along the wall by Fowler. Moves it quickly over to Kidd. And that's picked off. Grabs the puck. Sends it over to Fowler. Handles the puck. Moves it to Datsu. Boom! Oh, nowhere to go on the play. Sends the pass over. That pass doesn't go. Nowhere for that shot to go through. It's a two-on-one rush. Here's the pass. Whoa. And he scores. Whoa, James, while we're looking at this highlight, the coach is sour that they gave up this man advantage break, but it's beautifully executed, and it's in the net. The Oil Kings draw first blood here with an early goal. Not much to choose from in the first half of the period. Now you got a leader, and we'll see how this game plays out. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Fowler. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Toronto's ahead, 1-0. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. And he easily stops that one. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Fisher's won the draw here in the offensive zone. On the attack along the boards. Oh, and down he goes on the ice. Oh, he thought there was room. Obviously, there was none. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. And that's broken up. Quick feed to Datsu. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Datsu's got lots of tricks up his slip. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. They're trying to defend that lead aggressively, but they take a penalty. Now the penalty killers really have to do the job. Man advantage takes to the ice. It's our first opportunity to get a glance at the special teams unit. They might not get too many chances better than this, James. Down a goal and a critical power play. Scores! New game! At the very least, you don't want your power play to lose momentum. But when you've got a, a chance like this to even the score, you've got to come up big once in a while if you've got the extra player. 
they do, the power play clicks, and this game is tied. We know how strong he can be, guys, and we saw it there. The defender tried to jostle him off the puck, but he would not give it up. His unstoppable force zone ability was key in getting that assist. There's the whistle icing the call. Past the halfway mark of this period, it's all tied up. Fisher's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Oh, and that's got the crowd buzzing after that stop. Oh, he's all over that pass across the crease. Nice stop. Moves the puck across to Kidd. Play is called for offside. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Philadelphia's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Great reach with the puck check. Gains the zone through the middle. The Hurricanes take possession in the defensive end. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Looking for space inside the D zone. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Icing is the call. We'll get a reset. Here in the late goings of the period, we got a tie game. Toronto's won the draw and they'll go to work. The icing would have worn them down. That's a big face-off win for them. Fisher's won it off the face-off. And now it's over to Fowler. Can't get it to go. Takes the feed. Philadelphia's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And it's poked away in the neutral zone. Nice heads-up play there. Picked up along the wall by Boo. Couldn't complete the pass. Angles it over to Kidd. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck now. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Here's a short pass to Fisher. And we're going to get a face-off after the offside. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Gains the zone through center. And that's knocked away. And now he tries to get it across to Datsu. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got him with a toe. There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. Guys, this is a proud club. So proud. They want to remind themselves of the hard work they put in last season. Take a look at their banner here. We are so grateful to have clubs like them within this league. And I'm just excited to see what's to come from them. Period number two now underway. Let's see what this one has in store for us. That's a textbook save by Hoshik. Fowler's hauled down. Penalty on the way. 
Let's see what the officials say. Kids going off to the box for two minutes. The Hurricanes send their man advantage unit out once more. This is a confident power play group. They've already been on the board in this game, and they want more. You can just tell by how quickly they got out there. Here's a shot. Great save by the goaltender who was in the right place at the right time. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. Gains control of the puck here at the blue line. Can't connect on the shot. And that's picked off in front. Nice job to escape the zone. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Philadelphia's power play comes up empty-handed. We're back to even strength on the ice. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Kids getting called for tripping. Power play unit going back to work. It's kind of nice if you have a power play goal already in the game, which they do. Make sure the confidence continues to build and you try and get another. Philadelphia's got the puck in their own end. Can't connect on the pass. Here's the clearing attempt. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice. Get off the ice. Get some new people out there. Here's a shot. That one's off the blocker. Looking to make something happen along the boards. On the doorstep. Scores! And a little flex with the man advantage. Puts them in front. Well, this game is ground along in a tie score here, and you get a power play, you've got a chance to get an upper hand, and they do. They execute it perfectly. And now they have the lead. Oh, I thought he had this, James. He got a big chunk of it, but it just slowly trickled past him and into the net. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Philadelphia's moving it up the ice. Directed over to Pooh. Moves the puck along the half wall. Fisher's dangerous in the offensive zone. He's got it now, and he's already got the go-ahead goal. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Philadelphia's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. The Hurricanes ready to go on the attack. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. Sends it across. Trying to engage a little physicality here. And that's blocked. And now he angles it across to Fowler. Toronto's got possession at center. And no luck on that pass attempt. Moves the puck to Fowler. Delayed penalty coming up here. Whistle blown, stopping the play. This game weighs heavy on the penalty killer's shoulders now. They're down a goal and they have to keep it right there as they're short a player now. Another power play opportunity coming up here as they set up at the faceoff. Their coaches that run the power play couldn't be much more pleased than the way the power plays work tonight. James, this has been outstanding as they've been successful time and time again. And they get that puck down the ice. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. And a stick in the lane deflects that one away. Quick pass to Kidd. Trying to clear. And they get it down. Yeah, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Moves quickly over to Poo. Shoots it. Nothing. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. Great reach with the stick in the neutral zone by Fowler. Boom's moving the puck through his own zone. The Oil Kings PK unit delivers on that. Too passive, not aggressive enough. The puck gets moved around the outside of the penalty killers. Really doesn't become a dangerous power play. Past the midway mark in this period. Philadelphia's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Kids won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Can't get a hold of that pass. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. Tries to feed it over to Poob. Play is blown dead with the offside. 
Some last second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Fisher's won the draw here in the neutral zone. And that's knocked away by Kidd. Moves the puck. The Hurricanes gain possession. And that pass can't connect. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Dumps it in. Moves it to Whoa. Kidd. Aaron pass and they can't connect. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Levels them with the hit. Boom's got the puck. Let's it go. And not much on that one. Sends it over to Ezekiel. Nice defensive robbery on that. Quick feed to Datsu. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Oh, relentless pressure, and they come up with the turnover. Quick pass over to Fowler. Here's a shot. He scores! They tie it up! Well, they've been working hard to get this game back to level, and that goal will do it. He doesn't miss very often from in here. You get tight to the net, one of the most accurate shooters in the game. In the final moments of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Just rocked on the play. Man, you hear the old term bone jarring? That one had to hurt. The boards are still moving from that collision. Here's a short pass to Poo. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, a quick little pickpocket on the play. Odd man rush. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Oh, he didn't like that penalty. I mean, it is a trip. But he's yelling at the other guy lying on the ice. Stand up. Quit diving. The Oil Kings get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Hammersman from the point. And somehow he got a piece of that one. Fisher's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. They're ready to drop the puck on period number three. He's Ray Ferro. I'm James Sabolski. Let's do this. Toronto's man advantage is still intact as this period gets underway, and they win the draw. Moves it around along the half wall. Moves right to the middle, and that one's broken up by a great defensive play. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. Quick pass to Ezekiel. And now he moves it to Kidd. Toronto's going to play it from the corner. Pokes it away in his own end. Sends it to the opposite corner. The Oil Kings have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Ezekiel's got it across the line. And it's a quick pass to Kidd. Couldn't complete the play. Justin's ready to join the play. Philadelphia's PK unit comes up big as both sides are back to even strength. Well, the only thing that happened on that power play was the clock rolled along. Very few chances, not much danger. Philadelphia's got the puck. Tosses it to Fowler. Feeds the puck to Kidd. Gets it over to Datsu. Toronto's got the puck against the half wall. Denies him! 
Hasek's able to keep the score the same. He turns away a slot shot. Fails to find the open man. Takes the pass. Puck sent over to Ezekiel. And on the heels of that big hit, he's being called out. Fisher's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Rejected by the blocker. Toronto's got it across the line. Takes control of the puck. Just a simple oh! save. He's to the net. Puck's on his stick, puck's off his stick, and it's in the net with the accurate shot. He's just so accurate from that distance, guys. It's his close quarter superstar ability, and he can do some damage when he gets in tight to the net like that. From the neutral zone now, and he moves it up to Pooh. Unable to reach that one. Slides it across to Kidd. Takes a shot. Oh, and it slides just wide. They work the puck into position. The goalie's in good shape, but he doesn't even have to get a pad or an arm on it as it goes wide of the net. Into the corner now. Moves it quickly over to Poo. Toronto's got the puck. Well, there's no time to take your foot off the pedal now. This game is tight and it's going to go right down to the wire. Focus is important. And he makes the save. Oh, there's one more. He gets that one, too. I love the way that he's in position, and he's got the reflexes to bang out a couple of stops in a row. Well past the midway mark of this period, Toronto's been the better-looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one-goal lead. Brilliant save, read it perfectly. Centers are set, face off, ready to resume play. Toronto's won the draw. And they continue to apply pressure here. Philadelphia's got control of it now from their own end. Quick feed to Datsu. Philadelphia's got the puck here in the open ice. Nice pass. Philadelphia's got the puck against the boards. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Dishes it to Datsuk. Picked off in the offensive end. And that's a great defensive heads up to force the turnover. Boom against the wall. There's a little anger in that hit. I mean, he had him closed off. He could have just eased them in, but he lowered the boom. Denies him on the play. Justin's locked in. Every puck hits him and stays in front of him. On the odd chance there's a rebound, he tracks that well, too. And we'll reset things after that icing. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Good read by the winger as the two centers tie up. Receives the pass. Solid body contact. Philadelphia's looking to break out. Scooped up by Kidd. Here's a short pass to Fowler. Whoa! He scores! And how about that to even things up here late in the game? Well, they just stayed at it, James. I don't know if there's anything particularly beautiful about the play, but it doesn't even matter. You keep plugging away and look for the tying goal. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Kids want it. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. 
Toronto's ready to go on the attack. And that one's broken up. Quick pass to Fisher. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Tries to get it to Ezekiel. Broken up at center. Grabbed along the boards by Fowler. Gaining momentum along the boards. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Ezekiel's got it in the offensive end. Moves it to Kidd. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Slides the puck over to Justin. Philadelphia's playing it from the side. Here's a chance right in front. Moves it quickly over to Kidd. Shot. That's kicked away with the pad by Hasek. Philadelphia's got the puck in the defensive end. And they won't connect on that one. And that's picked off. There's the buzzer. 60 minutes of play has solved absolutely nothing. So let's go to overtime. And we'll do that next here on EA Sports. Are you hashtagging overtime challenge on social media? Because they're ready to get it underway. Puck is dropped and OT has begun. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. The Oil Kings have it now. With possession along the wall. And that's stolen and they'll go on the attack. Quick feed to Fowler. The Oil Kings gain control of the puck against the wall. Toronto's on the attack. Comes up with a stop. Deep inside the defensive zone, trying to clear the puck. And there we go. Icing is the call. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. The Oil Kings take possession off the faceoff. No room for that one to get through. Here's a short pass to Fisher. Stoppage in play offside the call. The setters will glide into the dot. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Slides the puck ahead to Boo. Can't find his man. Couldn't connect on that pass. Quick pass to Fowler. The Oil Kings look to start the transition game. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. The Hurricanes gain control of it. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Picked up along the boards by Kidd. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Takes the feed. Takes the shot. Puts it just wide of the net. Scooped up along the wall by Kidd. Shuts him down. He's got the puck with all sorts of traffic around him. Looking Whoa. to end it. What a save. He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Sorry for interrupting there, James. That was a huge hit. Off a stick. Philadelphia's looking to break out of their own end. Knocked away by Kidd. Way too much congestion blocks that. That's not going to fool him. Gaez explores his options in the corner. Moves it to Datsu. Philadelphia's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Poo. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Feeds it down low. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Kidd. 
slides the puck over. Ezekiel's been a leader of this team offensively, and tonight he's really at the front of the line. Three points already. Quick feed to Fisher. Great reach with the poke check by Kidd. Ezekiel's got the puck in his own zone. Routine save made by Hoshik. And that's a great heads up play in the offensive zone. And here comes the pushback. Fisher's ready to go. Apparently the other guy doesn't want anything to do with him. Denies him in close. Great stop for him post to post there. Datsuk's been looking for the door here to get off the ice after he was injured in the middle of this shift. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Philadelphia's won the faceoff. Here's a short pass to Fowler. Stopped with ease. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. From the boards, he takes that pass. And they can't connect. That pass doesn't go. Toronto's on the attack. And just a good old-fashioned solid body check on the play. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Not able to connect. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. Grabs it in his own end. Quick pass to Fisher. Toronto's got possession at center. Nice poke check. Fisher's got it now deep inside his own end. Couldn't complete the pass. Dadsoup's got it against the boards. And not much on that one. Hoshik's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Philadelphia's got it in the defensive zone. Fisher's taking it from his own end. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Poked away by Kidd. The Oil Kings will play it from the defensive zone. Moves it to Kidd. Oh, and a great defensive play there. Taken by Kidd. Right to the middle. Kick. Game on a stick. He wins it. He wins it. He wins it in overtime. And that'll close the book on this one as the final horn sounds. Well, Razor, you want to sum this one up for us? Yeah, bad choice, bad decisions. We've all made them. Those guys just made one. I believe the term is stay in your lane.